Hey y'all, uh, we're going to be doing some work on our uh, clutch and brake pedal assembly here and uh, just want to show you some tips and tricks on how to get this out of here. Um, we're going to be replacing all these little bushings in here, our uh, clutch and, well, hard to simulate it out of the truck, but um, there's just a lot of play in the, in the bushings there. They're all wore out and I don't think they've ever been replaced or it doesn't look like it at least. Um, and so here's the kit that we found on Amazon. I think it was 20 bucks. And uh, I'm just gonna replace those bushings. Then we're also gonna do a hem joint here uh, for our clutch. Really the hardest part of getting all this out is trying to get these uh, out of the firewall because um, you can't really pull this up against anything. The pedals start hitting the floor, and whatever. Uh, but then for the brake, you've got these. Um, the studs are actually under the hood. There we go, these four studs that go and through your firewall, but then this one, you know, you've got the studs on the assembly that come through to here. Um, you're gonna have to pull all of this stuff out. Um, this one, uh, once I unclipped this, the whole assembly came out. You got a bunch of like prevent lines and you know, like fragile stuff. So be careful when you're pulling this. And then under the truck here, there's some other stuff you're gonna have to be doing. Um, whenever you take off, your switch for the brake there's going to be these little bushings and washer that's going to fall off make sure you find those um and then you just push your uh steering rod you know all the way down in there don't let it go too far you don't want to go fishing for that um yeah and then once you get that out you just gotta wiggle it out and it'll eventually come out um yeah this was definitely one of the harder ones too trying to get it past that but uh, that's what it is there. And now we'll go and uh, do some work on this, replace the bushings. Uh, one thing I have seen is that you're gonna wanna mark this right here because this is like a, uh, it's got, you know, like a like little gear groove that sets in. So, um, you know, to go ahead and scribe you a line. But yeah, that, that's how you get this thing out. Not too bad, um, but definitely takes a little bit of time. All right, y'all, we got it all buttoned up, put back together now. Uh, looks pretty good in here. Definitely a lot better than just pushing in on the clutch. I mean, it just, there's just no more play in anything up here. It just, right as you start pushing in on the clutch, it, it just works. Yeah, doesn't squeak anymore. It's great. Um, you're gonna have to cut this eyelid off. That's usually right up here. Um, you just cut it off and uh, grind it down so that it'll fit inside the hem joint there. Um, you're gonna have to take your linkage apart here, this bolt, that bolt, pull it out, slide the shaft down and, and through the firewall, and then the whole assembly will slide right out. Okay, uh, got any questions, uh, post comment and I'll uh, do my best to answer it. Take care.